In order to assemble your Madagascar cage, you will need the box of parts, a screwdriver, and pliers. This may be a two-person job, but by following these instructions, you should be able to assemble the cage within 45 minutes. Begin with the front and side panels. Make sure they're standing up with the gaps on the bottom and the doors facing out. Notice that the side panels have screws already in place, ready for use. Line the front panel up at a 90 degree angle with one of the side panels. Untwist the screws on the side panel, then screw them into the front panel. Don't tighten any of the screws until the assembly is complete. Continue this process with the other side panel and the back panel until your cage looks like this. All four panels screwed together and standing on their own. Make sure the back panel is standing in this direction, with the small divider bar at the bottom. Next, you will be attaching the roof panel. Notice the screws already in place on the top of the side panels. These will hold the roof in place. Untwist the screws, then slowly lower the roof panel onto the top of the cage. The roof should fit between the front and back panel, then can be screwed into the side panels. The cage should now look like this, with all four side panels and roof in place. Now you can put in the bottom of the cage by inserting the pull-out tray into the very bottom gap, then inserting the bottom grate with the handle into the top gap. Next, attach the locks onto the front doors with the eight flathead screws provided in the box. First, screw the flat part onto the cage. Then loosely screw the lock system onto the door with the handle halfway turned. Repeat this with the other door, then add the shelves and ladders into the cage. Now that the cage construction is complete, you can move on to the cage stand. First, find the two cage base legs. You'll be using eight of the shorter screws and nuts to attach the cage holder bars. Simply place the bars with the flat edge on the outside and square side on the inside, and twist on the nuts and screws. Make sure the curved edge on the bar is facing up to ensure that the cage doesn't fall off the stand. Tighten the nuts using the screwdriver and pliers, and the stand should now look like this. Find the cage accessory shelf, and four longer screws and nuts. Attach the shelf by placing it onto the bottom cage base legs and screwing them in. Now that the cage stand is put together, you can leave it stationary or add wheels to make your cage mobile. Simply push the wheels into the bottom of the stand legs and the stand is complete. Tighten all screws and carefully lift up your cage and place it onto the stand. This finishes the assembly of your Madagascar cage. To maintain your cage, try Cage Clean, a hard-working yet gentle cage and accessory cleaner. Visit our website for hundreds of options for your cage, like exercise wheels, climbing branches, and more.